<sighs> you ever like to just separate yourself? Just kind of be with yourself and think? Enjoy nature, hear the birds chirping, right? Sunshine, fresh air. It's really healthy for you to kind of separate yourself. It's a good time to think, right? Thinking is an important, important thing for us to do to help us to succeed, to stay healthy, but you gotta think in a way that is actually providing something of value, right? So sometimes I separate myself and I start to look around and see what kind of lessons I can learn. Like an example, right here behind me, if you can see this, there's a whole vineyard right here, right? And as I was sitting here, I'm looking, looking at the birds flying around. They come right here and hang out on the fence, kind of chirp at me, I chirp back. <laughs> but as I'm looking at this, I'm like, man, this is a powerful lesson right here. Because right here, like you got to think like a farmer to plant these, like there's patience involved. Like first they got to break up the soil, right? They, they start to measure structure, where the vines are going to go and how, where to put the plants and how to, you know, support them so that they, you know, grow strong. Now you got to wait. <laughs> you know, I want my wine already, right? I want to be enjoying that wine already, but that's not how the process works. You got to break up the soil. You got to put in the work and plant the seed and not just any seed. You got to plant the right seed, right? See, if you don't plant the right seed, it's going to grow the wrong fruit, right? So the same thing in our life. If you're not planting the right seeds, if you're not planting the right actions, the right beliefs, I need to learn how to think like a farmer in a way where, man, my life is this crop where I need to break up the ground, get rid of rocks, get rid of things that are messing up the results that I want, the fruit that I want in my life. Sometimes those things are like my stinking thinking, my limited beliefs, maybe doubt, self-doubt, maybe some guilt or some fear, some, some, some anger or offense, or I'm holding something against somebody. See, those are type, the type of things that are like the, the, the weeds, the rocks in the soil, in the heart. And it really messes up how you think, what you do, your actions, your behaviors. And after a while, your, your repetition becomes your reputation. So because of the seeds that you planted, those actions are coming out and that's what you're known for. So think like a farmer. Be more intentional with the seeds that you're planting in your life because every seed produces after its own kind. You plant some negative, seed today you're gonna to have some negative fruit tomorrow it's really common sense right so think like a farmer when you want some better action some better results in your life whether it's in your relationships in your career and business in your health and fitness like know the seeds like okay if i want that fruit i need to produce i need to plant this seed it's real simple take care of the seed water it nurture it protect it because that's going to produce the results that you want and now now the rest of your life is truly becoming the best of your life because the seeds that you're intentionally planting. So think like a farmer. Hey guys, Richard Martinez here, the growth guy. Just wanted to thank you for watching this video. If you liked it and you enjoyed it and you got some value from it, then like it and give me a comment. And then also make sure that you push that subscribe button to make sure that you get notified when I put some more good content on there. So besides that, you're more than enough. All things are possible and I'll see you at the next video. Come on, go.